Welcome back to Darkwood. It's day seven. It's time to go to the Silent Forest. Now, looking at this, we're supposed to meet with the wolf over on the west side of the Silent Forest, but given how long it takes me to get from here to here... Well, I guess it's not that long to get from here to here, but there is a very nice pathway that makes it super obvious where to go, and I don't really have to slow down, worried about too many enemies. I'm just thinking, do I really want to go all the way from here to here? I mean, by the time I get here, it might be nighttime or something. At the same time, I'm thinking that perhaps there's more than one hideout. Maybe there's a hideout for the Silent Forest, and a, and a hideout or two for the Old Woods. So, maybe I should just look for a hideout? I don't really know. Heck, maybe the Wolf's Camp is a hideout. So I'm not sure if I'm going to push through or just start to poke at the Silent Forest and then make my way back here. <clears throat> anyway, Trader's here. I don't think I have anything in particular to sell. Nope, I think I'm pretty good. Again, I am heading to the Silent Forest, though. I want to make sure I've got enough stuff. So definitely extra battery. Bring in my meat, my lockpicks, my bandages, my two weapons. Yeah, alright, that should be fine. Let's check in with the trader real quick. Just to see if they say anything. Nope, okay. You know what, just in case I do find a hideout, I think I should take some fuel with me. Yeah, I'll take a full one. Just in case I have to hunker down over there. Alright, let's turn off the generator and then head to the silent forest. feeling the Silent Forest is going to be substantially different. I get the feeling it's going to be harder and more unforgiving. So from here it's pretty much straight left. Of course there's the dogs there. There's the beetle. <laughs> A.K.A. the rabbit. Ooh. There's a body over there. I don't know if I searched it. Hmm. Ah. Oh, bunch more gas. Okay. Straight left. Silent Forest? It's so thick. Oh no. Let's get on my flashlight. Location found. Entrance to Silent Forest. What is that? I don't know what that was. It looked more like a beetle, but it very well might not have been. No, I think that is a beetle, but that one might be dangerous. It looked kind of poisonous. Yeah, get out of here. Oh, generator. This is a safe house, isn't it? It's got power, too. Ooh. Beautiful. Okay. Whoa. 
Woo, 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 woo. I think I just saw that chair moving, so I think there's something in there. Molotov. More gas. Let's put that Molotov here. That's a hole. Am I going to fall down if I touch it? This place is infected with something toxic. I need to find a way to get rid of it. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Writhing worms with a body stuck in it. So I'm guessing this is the only way through the silent forest, right? I'd have to clear the infection. Hmm. I want to touch a hole to see what happens, but at the same time, I don't. Okay, pretty sure there's a monster in here. Ah, damn it, need a key. Well, if I have to spend the night here, I could spend it right here, right? But then again, I don't know if it has the gas going, you know? It's not just light, it's also the protective gas. So what do I do then? This side's need this side needs a passcode, the other side needs a key. Maybe I should touch one of the holes and see if I fall down it. I'm just gonna leave that generator on for a sec. I don't know, what if I drag this over a hole? That didn't do anything. Okay, I'm gonna stand on the hole. Nothing. the infection for a second. Mm. Oh, can I break it with this? Am I actually breaking it? I see stuff coming apart. I think I might be breaking it. Am I breaking the door or am I just breaking my tools? It sounds like I'm break. Ah, but if I keep hitting it, I'm not even going to have a weapon to use on the person inside. Can't craft much. Alright, I'll just run if I have to. I think I'm just breaking my tools. I really can't tell. Now I have literally no weapon except a Molotov. Guess that'll be my main weapon. So I'm just, I'm really not sure what to do. Is there something I need to do here, or do I need to explore around other places and find something? Because I, I mean, it looks like I've explored pretty thoroughly. What if I threw a Molotov onto this? Would it burn it? I'm gonna make a torch. It just hurt me a little bit. Oh! That worked! Is it the fire that's hurting it, or just hitting it?
Well, thank God I found this. If I hadn't have found this, then I would be very stuck. I really wish I hadn't have, I think, wasted my weapons on that door. Animals. Yeah, that needs a passcode too. Looks like cattle, and then I don't know what that is, but these two look like cows. Oh, what is that? Oh god, it's a huge egg. Is that where the bugs come from? Something is floating inside. The skin looks to be quite thin. Maybe I could puncture or pierce it with something? <laughs> no. <sighs> oh, this leads to the house. Again, I'm pretty sure there's a monster inside the house. Because I saw that chair move and I heard something. It's a bug. I think I should craft another torch. Never mind, I can't. Gel. Worth 20. It's not bad. Oh, I just closed that door. Alright, I've got the generator on. Can't open it even from the inside. Can I craft anything now? Not really. Do I have anything to even swing with? No. I get the feeling the password or a key or something is probably on whatever's inside of here. I'm gonna do it. Molotov. Did it die? Oh, thank God it did. Oh. Staff. Can I use that as a weapon? I can, thank God. I wonder how much damage it does. Alright. Got a weapon. Oh, shit, the generator ran out of power, didn't it? stone. Completely full at this point. Oh, a note. Ah, the door code is 3333. It can't get any easier. Remember it. I'm not opening that door after dark anymore. I want to get some gasoline from the pig shed. Or I went to get some gasoline from the pig shed. I'll be back after dark. Are they inside of the egg? I think I'll dump these three nails in favor of the pill. And 
let's fill up this generator too. I'm not actually sure if this is a safe house. Because I don't see the safety gas. I guess just for the sake of freeing up some inventory space and assuming this will be a safe house, I'm going to dump another one into it. Guess I'll turn it back on for now. Should I go whack the egg? I just don't have the freaking key to this. I don't absolutely need it, but it would sure be good. What was I coming over here for? I guess just for the egg, right? I feel like there's something else I was going to do. Oh, I think I was going to move this and see if there's something beneath it. Well, it looks like they've carved some more symbols and stuff into the ground, but that's about it. Guess I'll grab the nails, too. Still can't make a torch. Something I'm wondering before I break this egg is, can I pour gas onto the ground and light it on fire? I'm wondering. Ooh. Possibly. Can I throw matches? Haha! -ha. So gas itself can be a weapon. Well, I'm gonna burn this egg then instead of whacking it with a stick. Christ. I thought you might be able to do that. Sounded like something it would let you do. Oh, was that not close enough? There we go. Embryo. Oh. Oh no, I don't think I want that. I guess I didn't need to burn it. I was worried something horrible would come out of it, but... I mean, that is something horrible, but at least it's not immediately dangerous to me. I can't tell if it's... Oh, it is turning dark. Yeah. So, wait, just one sec. Let me run in here. It says hideout. Okay, it says... I'm gonna pause just so I don't waste time. It says hideout in the top left of the screen if you're actually in a hideout up here. And it's not saying that even with the generator on and the lights on, so I need to run the hell home right now. Like, holy shit. I spent way too much time here. Let's try to take the most direct route possible. Northeast. Maybe go across the wolf's camp. Oh shit! Christ! Uh-oh, 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 this is bad. Oh 
Holy shit. Okay, there's a wolf's camp, so I'm not that far from home. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Almost home. Almost home. There's home. I see home. Generator! Okay, I get the hideout effect just from being near it. Good. Oh, that is not much power. Let's drink. Okay, healed us up all the way. Okay, whew. Oh, that was scary. Uh, yeah, the staff seems to be pretty good. It killed a dog in two hits, which is the same as the boards. Let's dump a bunch of stuff. Freaking embryo. Should I just sell that as soon as possible, just because it's creepy? Um. Uh oh. You got chains on every window and all that. Okay. Interesting that there's generators at places that aren't hideouts. Um, why did it just move? Is it possessed or was that a bug? I hope that was just a bug. Oh no, that's not a bug. The other one's moving too. Fuck me. Let's see if I can go make another chain trap real quick. Yes. Do I have one already made? No.
the calming sound of daybreak. I'm pretty sure once you start hearing that, I don't think you're in any danger. Whew. note i think i'm gonna end this episode here so i hope you've enjoyed so far and when i return we're gonna begin day eight and now that i have unlocked the entrance to the silent forest i guess we're going to enter the silent forest for real <laughs>